What's going on, degenerates? Yeah, I'm a Hodge Twins wannabe, whatever. I don't have another person by me going, I work it! Grandma's pudding! You're a serial killer! Anyway, yeah, I've been watching the Hodge Twins, man. Me and the live stream love it. What is going on, people? It's been a while since the, uh, the last, uh, live stream. I mean, wait, no, I stream every day. Oh, uh, video log, yes. Uh, this is video log number, uh, 250 something, no, 190, uh, I don't know. Anyway, I lost count. But it's been a while. What's going on, everyone? Hopefully everyone's had a great holiday. Hopefully everyone's had a good January. I know I have. Um, lots of things, man. Diet still going good, down to about 265, going a little bit up and down. Uh, a lot of weight training, getting a lot of muscle, cutting a lot of fat. So it's kind of like, you know, it's like I lose five pounds during a week, and then I gain three back. And I lose five, and I gain three. I lose five, and I gain three. But it's not bad, because the gaining is making gains. Making all kinds of gains. Loving it. And um, right now, basically, I'm on a... You know, uh, it's like I, I kind of fast for about a couple of days during the week. So I got like on Tuesdays, I mean Mondays and Thursdays, I, I uh, train with my trainer and we do our thing. And basically, um, you know, on those days, I always eat a lot of protein, lean meat stuff to recover, uh, glutamine, you name it. On like Wednesdays and, and Tuesdays and all the other days, I kind of fast. I kind of just drink juices, lots of water. Uh, I try, you know, have little snacks like banana chips and bananas and wheat bread every now and then, little pieces of wheat bread here and there. But uh, yeah, I know, man, the hair is like everywhere. Like, it's like I'm froing, bro. I don't know. I just don't feel like cutting it because it kind of looks decent, you know? Like, with, you know, I kind of look full body figure decent with the hair. I, I love it. Um, but yeah, let's go. Let's get right to some few updates here. Daisy standalone video just came out. Uh oh. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. I can't wait. It's, oh my God, it's going to be great. Uh, yeah, we're going to be rocking that. Uh, Twitch been great. January was the best month I've had on Twitch. Best month ever on Twitch. Average about 2,550 viewers. Yeah, there's all like these small little trolls that have the, well, Tally, you used to have like 6,000 viewers. Now you have like 3,000. Motherfucker, I never had no 5,000, 6,000 viewers. Maybe like two days when Mr. Pandaria came out. Hell, man, if I had that many viewers, I'd probably want to fucking slip my Justin Cup for Bieber wrists. Sheesh. But uh, I've been having a great time. Average the highest amount in the since I started streaming, 2550 was amazing. Ad revenue, on the other hand, bad. January, February, March, April, who knows, man? Ad revenue is bad. Who can we blame it on? We don't know. Is it the ad agencies? Maybe they're not giving enough money to Twitch and the other companies. Maybe that's why Own3D went down, man, because of the support. I mean, Twitch is really uh, fueled by esports and advertising through them. And lately... Um, you can tell that ad blocking is like the fucking number one criminal for like YouTube, live streaming, Ustream, Livestream.com, Twitch, uh, Hulu, or whatever you want to name it. Everyone now is coming up with these like monthly fees to watch with perks to watch shit commercial free. Recently, Twitch came out with Turbo. It's an amazing thing. I, I already purchased my Turbo. Basically, you go in, you go, you, you have no commercials anywhere on Twitch. Right, and you have your own little like emotes and shit like that, and um, you know, the cool thing about it is for us broadcasters, with that turbo, we still get credit when we play the ads. So if I see someone in the channel with a turbo and I play an ad, they still count toward my ad revenue. So Twitch is basically picking up the tab for the people who have the turbo button, who would have seen a commercial who would have seen a commercial. Same thing goes for subs. Now, for me, I have an amazing subscriber program, so I don't think my channel, it hasn't. I mean, in the past 24 hours, I've only gained subscribers. I haven't lost any. Um, people are saying that a lot of channels that don't have a lot of good sub programs, unlike this person, uh, are going to be suffering a lot. People are going to start unsubbing from channels and doing the whole turbo thing, and hopefully this encourages other channels with sub buttons to do more for their fan base and viewer base to keep them as subs to gain that extra, uh, you know, income every month. I know for me, the sub button is like a fucking godsend. That's why I give so much back. I give over like a thousand, twelve hundred dollars, even more uh, a month back to the subscribers from the subscriber program. Now, the revenue thing was really fucked up this month. I mean, we were people like myself, Mufasa, like other live streamers, Mia Rose, whoever you name it, you know, we're all getting like 1,500, 1,900, 2,000 average viewers more. And, uh, you know, basically, I'll give you a perfect example. My best sub Sunday happened in January, averaged about 5,100 viewers the entire 10 hours, uh, made like 50 bucks. On any normal month, 
I would have made probably like 300. Easy, easy. But the ad revenue is so bad at the beginning of the year in that quarter that, I mean, we don't even know if it's due to ad blocking. We don't know if it's just due to ad agencies not providing enough. We don't know. Like, we, we don't get those kind of answers uh, from Twitch or anything like that. And we, we don't really need to have those answers. We just basically have to, like, find other methods. Right now, the most popular way people are making their revenue is obviously stream commercial free, donate, like Rekful. Man, Rekful's rock, racking, rocking, racking. <laughs> He's wrecking. Like, <laughs> Over 10 grand, 15 grand a month easy off donations because that's his strategy. He knows that the ad revenue is like so bad that, you know, and people love him, man. I mean, he got like Russians and Koreans and everything in his channel. The guy's a fucking legend, man. And, you know, a lot of channels are doing the whole commercial free donate and it does seem to work. I mean, I put up a chip in because the revenue was so bad for about seven days and I raised for like four thousand five hundred and fifty plus dollars. In seven days, I didn't even have the chip in there the entire month. I just had it there for seven days, you know. And if it comes to that in February, well, it's going to happen. If it comes to that in March, it's going to happen, you know. I do whatever I have to do to keep streaming, just like anyone else, you know. This is a business, you know. You got you to gotta adapt to the environment. You got to do what you got to do to keep your fans entertained and to keep doing what you're doing. You know, some people say, Tally, you give too much back uh, in terms of uh, money to your live stream. You know, you should cut back on that. No, I'm not going to cut back on that. I'm not. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to continue doing my game time giveaways. I'm going to continue promoting WoW. I'm going to continue promoting any game that I like to play myself. And I'm going to continue getting my community involved. I'm going to keep spending that two, $300 every sub Sunday to buy the games that the subs want me to play. I'm going to keep giving out $1,000 worth of prizes to the subs. Everyone's going to stay the same. Everyone's going to stay happy. We're all going to not change. There's no need to change because you always have the support of your fans whenever it is needed. You know, you can have those two or three little trolls that always come in talking, hey, well, you're a little greedy bastard because you have a donate button, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, whatever, man. Suck my dick. I was the only live streamer for a year and a half that didn't have a donate button. Suck it. And if I have one now, so be it. It's going to happen. That's why I always said 2011, 2012 was about building the live stream, building the fan base, you know, showing people who I am. Showing them how I roll, how I conduct my live stream, how I care about this industry, and how I care about the people that view every day. You know what I'm saying? That's how I am. 2013 is going to be about building the community. It's going to be basically about uh, building. A, we're going to be we're going to be building a, a, a fucking stream forum that's going to be insane with contests every day. We're going to have a, a, a fucking live stream event that's going to be heavily moderated. Every single user is going to require their own personal password to get in. No one can just get in. It's going to be like a lot, a lot of shit going on in 2013. It's going to be about bringing the community together, playing together, not having those people saying, well, I don't like playing this game because, you know, I'm lonely and I'm forever alone and I have no friends to play with. We're going to create friends for everyone to play with. We're going to all be there if you want to be there. All right, so I hopefully uh, 2013 is going to be a lot better. It's off to a wonderful start already. I, it can only get better uh, from here on out. Uh, Own 3D, uh, shit the bed. A um, lot of people coming back to Own 3D. Athena's back doing his charities, as usual. Great for him. Uh, Swifty's back doing late night giveaways, like past midnight. So you European dudes are probably around for that. Um, Pooksy's back. Boy, boy, like all these, all the cursed dudes. CLG. I think Hot Shots was streaming before. Um, it's like, like the League of Legends channel has exploded. Dota, Toby One, Toby One is back. Toby One is on Twitch. I can't, I love watching the defense every day. It's fucking amazing. Um, and it's just great, man, to see all this traffic coming in through Twitch. Now, the the thing that's gonna happen, 2013, is we just want to hope that Twitch can like maintain this momentum and just keep going, man. Start hiring more staff, more, 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 more to work on all these different streamers and work on all these different projects that I'm pretty sure they have going. So good for Twitch. Sucks for O3D, but kind of saw that coming, man. Hopefully Destiny and the rest of those dudes get their cut, get their paid due for what they signed initially when they were with them. And uh, that's pretty much about it. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Tally. Come check it out today. That's about all the thoughts I had in my head. Let me see. I'll do another video tomorrow. Peace. Ow! Pentakill! Pentakill!